Welcome back to Alliance Online Training. In this video I will demonstrate on, how to generate, purchase invoice. Click on, purchase. Click on, purchase invoice. Add a new, purchase invoice. You can generate purchase invoice by copy from two documents, namely, purchase order, or goods receive. If you copy from purchase order, for quantity on hand, and quantity available will be increase, once generated purchase invoice. On the other hand, if you copy from goods receive, for quantity on hand and quantity available, will not be increase. Now I will demonstrate on direct generate, purchase invoice. Insert vendor. Insert supplier invoice number. Select the warehouse. Example for the item will be, dark chocolate. I can use the shortcut key, to change the price to 1, and quantity to 20. Click on post to generate, purchase invoice. Meanwhile, AP invoice will be auto generated. Let me show you on the AP invoice. Click on account payable, click on AP invoice. Select the AP invoice that just created. This is the AP invoice that auto created, once generate purchase invoice. Now, I will demonstrate on, how to generate purchase invoice, copy from purchase order. Before that, let us have a look on quantity of white chocolate, as you will see the changes of the quantity, once we generate purchase invoice copy from purchase order. Click on inventory. Click on item. Select white chocolate. Click on warehouse and quantity. Previously I had generated purchase order on white chocolate. Therefore, you will see quantity ordered is 50. Now we will proceed to generate purchase invoice. Click on purchase. Click on purchase invoice. Select the vendor that same as the purchase order that we generated previously. Moreover, select copy from purchase order. You can do full transfer or partial transfer. We will demonstrate by partial transfer. Insert supplier invoice number. Insert star 30 to change the quantity to 30, or you can also change the quantity, by double click this column. Click post once confirmed. Back to the item page, and click on refresh button. Click on warehouse and quantity. Before the partial transfer from purchase order. It shows ordered quantity is 50. After the partial transfer of 30 quantity, it shows quantity on hand is 30. Quantity available is 30 and quantity order left 20. Now, I will show on generate purchase invoice, for the balance 20 quantity. Back to purchase invoice, and click on refresh button. Select the vendor, and copy from purchase order. Select partial transfer, and you may direct select balance stock, that haven't transfer from this purchase order. Insert supplier invoice number and post. Back to item page, and click on refresh. Select warehouse and quantity, and you will see quantity on hand, and quantity available is 50. No more quantity order left. Hope you enjoy this video, and thank you for watching. IRS is your business, is your life.